Hey my pretties, welcome back. So as you can see, I went through Walmart, I picked up a few things. I didn't show you guys that I did go to Target and I grabbed a few things from there as well. I just did a couple little clips inside of Walmart. So I want to share uh, with you guys the few pieces that I did pick up. Now, before I jump into the clothes, I just pulled these out of the deep freezer because you guys, I picked up some weird flavor ice creams and i'm gonna throw these back in the freezer because i think we're gonna do that in a whole different video but because i don't want them to sit out in the in the heat right now um let me just show you guys the um ice creams that i picked up so the reason why i was on the hunt for these originally was because of this flavor right here uh, i'm probably a little late because i think these have been out for i don't know a couple months like three four months i don't know i think they were like summer flavors but when I seen this gray coupon, I was like, okay, I got to go to Walmart and try to find that. And then I ended up finding four additional flavors. So this is limited edition gray coupon with salted pretzels, French ice cream right there. So I was just like, I don't know if this is like a mustard flavored ice cream. Is it vanilla? I don't even know you guys. I do not know and I didn't even read this. I don't know, but we are gonna find out. We are gonna find out. I'm not opening it right now. We are gonna get back into the clothes. Then I don't know what possessed me to pick up pizza flavored ice cream. Pizza. Why? I still do not know. But we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna see. Um wild blueberry shortcake. Now that sounds good. So that's what that looks like. And then this one was really I'm really interested in this one as well. Honey cornbread with strawberry jam French ice cream. And then the last one that I can't wait to try is the summer peach crisp right there. So those are the five flavors that I grabbed from Walmart. I'm gonna go ahead and put these back and then we'll hop into the clothes. But I wanted to show you guys these and let you know that that's gonna be in a separate video. So I have all the clothes right here on the table in separate pals from Walmart and from Target. Um, so we're gonna start with the shoes. At Target, I went ahead and picked up these cute little house shoes, the stars above. They're just the little furry ones and they're purple. Uh, you guys know I love purple, so I tried to tell myself, well, these would be for fall. <laughs> so I grabbed these, and these were $18. These shoes right here, Target, super cute. They came also in a black, how much were they? $30. They also came in black um, with the gold buckle. But to me, and I love black. I love me. I am a definitely a black and gold girl. But however, I didn't like the gold on the black pair because it looked like a yellow gold, like a almost like an orange kind of gold. It wasn't the same as this. So I didn't want to go with those. I think these are super cute. They are very, very comfortable. Something to just throw on, slide on. And of course, you guys know I love that big gold chain in the front. So yeah, I had to snag these. Now, I tried on all of the clothes except for these last two items, well, these first two items. Um, I, I forgot I had a separate bag and so, but they're just a pair of jeans and they were on clearance. So, uh, I picked these up at the last minute. Right here, the Universal Threads, Mid-Rise Skinny, they have a lot. You Most of the time I go in Target, I usually tend to forget to look for the clearance items. Because they, I mean, depending on each store, all the stores don't have a lot of clearance. But this one particular store, they have like a whole section of clearance. And if you get there on the right day, you can find all kind of stuff. Uh, there was a lot. However, I didn't pick up a lot. I just picked up two pairs of jeans. So, like I said, you got these. Um, I think the original price of them were $25 and I got them for $12.50. And it's just this pretty green that I thought would be cute going into fall right there and these are the ones that did these have this no these don't have the rips on them or anything they're not distressed it's just a regular pair of like just your regular jeans uh the next pair that i'm about to show you so for 12.50 that was a good deal the next pair i'm about to show you does have the distressed area in the knee so like right there how you have the rips and also on this side right here and these were also on clearance, same style pants, same everything. Uh, these are called high rise skinny. And how much were these? 
these were originally 30 um i think due to the distressing in them but i got them for 15 dollars yellow tag so half off and yeah i mean your basic colors white i always keep white pants black pants um yeah so getting those on clearance was a good deal okay so i love stars above pajamas um to me, they can be a jogging suit. Like it doesn't have to be pajamas. Nobody labeled them as pajamas. They in the pajama section, but you know how it is. We could do whatever we want to do, right? <laughs> so I picked up multiples of these. I am guilty. I am one of those people that if I find something I really, really like and I know it's gonna fit cute, I'm going with whatever colors they have. So I went with the stars above. The top is 20 and I go with different sizes because um, you know, you can buy them separate. They're not like a two piece set. You buy them separate. And so I go for an extra large with the top and I got this cute little cheetah print. I think that's cheetah. Is that cheetah? Like a little cheetah print. And going into fall, this will be cute to put on. Like I said, whether I'm wearing it as pajamas or if I'm running, um, outside trying to see where to put the top. If I'm running to the grocery store or I just need to go run to get ice cream or pick up pizza who knows but these are super comfortable if you've had a stars above little jogger set because the pants are jogger style um if you have one of these you already know what i'm talking about super comfortable stretchy warm not too thick not too thin they're just perfect so that's why i'm saying pajamas oh yeah we wearing this outside <laughs> And for my pants, I go with a 2XL. The top was an extra large. Um, yeah, so I, I like that they're separated because if I had to get the pants in a 2XL, the top I don't need in a 2XL, but you know, so it's always good that you can get these separate. So um, they had the cute little tie in the front and everything like that. I love these. And because I like the way they fit, I went ahead and I picked up the gray pair. Same fit, same everything, just different colors. So the gray pair, there's the bottom and the top. And then I also went with this color with the bottom and the top. And same size in all of them. I will try my hardest to find everything in Target and link them down below just in case you guys are interested in any of these. Okay, so here's another universal thread in extra large. This was $28 and it's just your basic little uh, sweater, you know, cardigan sweater. And they have these in different colors. They had them in, I think they were gray. I know I saw gray, gray, black, and this like off-white color. And it's just your basic piece. Um, I'm really um, big on having my basic pieces because I can mix and match and put them with whatever I want to put them with. Like this color will go with so many different things. A pair of jeans, a dress, whatever color. So I like to have my basic pieces. I can even layer. You know, we don't layer in Cal. I don't, we don't layer in California. I don't see people layering in California because it's not, it's never that, that cold. And it's always hot. <laughs> So, cause I was about to say, I could technically put on one of the pajama sets and then throw this on over it if I was running out, maybe at night. It would have to be like two in the morning when it's super cold and the temperatures drop. Then I might be able to layer, but besides that, other, but other than that, I'm not layering anything. So yeah, but I love, excuse me, feel like I got a piece of hair in my eye. I love this little cardigan. Okay, so when I saw this one and it's by Knox Rose for $45, I was on the fence about this because I've never really cared too much about like the cheetah print cardigans. And I know like last year and the year before they were super popular and everybody was wearing the cheetah print. print. I did get the, the, the pajamas, but when it comes to these sweaters, I'm usually, yeah, I try to stay away. But when I saw this one, I just fell in love with it. I think because the cheetah print is bigger and bolder and there's a lot of black in it. And I like that the material looks like that when you fold the sleeve over. And I just really, really like this one. And it's nice and big and it's oversized and it hangs low and it's super soft. And yeah, so... I had to convince myself to get this one. I did get it in a large. They do run a little big. So, um, 
usually I would have picked up like an extra large, um, but I sized down to a large. So like if you wear a medium, you might want to get a small. It just depends on how big you want it to fit. But I thought this was nice. It does have pockets. And so, yeah, I just really like it. And then when the front is rolled over like this and this part is showing, it's cute because it matches the sleeves if you fold up the sleeves. So you got the different patterns or different kind of look with that one. So Knox Rose for the win on that one. Okay, so they have, Target has this uh, area right now. This is by Original Use. And it was, it was in the front of the store and it was a lot of um, uh, like sportswear, like the, the striped pants, the like almost like the basketball clothing, like the, the pants to match the jacket. So when I seen all of that, they had a lot of different colors. I thought all of it was cute, but I just, I'm not, I'm not big unless, yeah, I just wasn't feeling the pants with the, with the jacket because the pants were really big at the bottoms and kind of like, um, not, definitely not, um, not, what word am I looking for? I don't know, but the bottoms were too big and I didn't like the way the pants fit. So I just went with the jacket. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, and it's real sporty. I love the black and white, but then it has the little green piping. Can you see that? It's like a forest green. So it has the green going down it on both sides of the black as well as right here on the shoulder. Um, and so, yeah, I like this jacket. Super cute. Um, I'm always real casual when I go out and stuff to work, especially once it starts to cool down. So this is perfect for me because I can throw this on with anything, any one of my t-shirts and some jeans and I'm out the door. And I really like that. They had red and black. They had a few different colors, but this green, black, and white was, it just stood out to me and it was perfect. So we went with that. Did I tell you how much it was? That jacket was only $25. Okay, now moving into Walmart stuff. I did pick up these tennis shoes. Uh-oh. I picked up these tennis shoes that I showed you guys in my previous video when I did my walkthrough. And they were $30, $29.98. And I just think they're really, really nice. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I tried them on. I think they're cute. They they fit comfortable. I love the shoelaces on them, how they have the brown and white. And this will be cute with like just, you know, some kind of jeans. And then e e any one of the little sweaters that I just showed you guys, the cheetah print, the all white, like cream color one will go good with this with something. So yeah, I just grabbed these because I think I can um, mix and match these with a few outfits in the winter. And look at how the the bottom is i like that how it's brown in the back and white in the front that's kind of cute okay you guys we're gonna start with this one <laughs> that's sophia sweater dress the one in the video that i was like oh my god that is so pretty that burgundy one with the bow thing going on in the back this one right here it's in the thumbnail picture of my other video and sorry it's probably messed up but it has that little crisscrossy thing back here in the back you guys let me tell you i put this thing on now the dress fits perfect it's super cute i love it i absolutely love it the material is nice i just love the way this looks and i love this color now when i put this baby on <laughs> this part went across my back i'm probably showing you in a clip or something like that but this part went across and this bottom part right here, that, that's drooped down at the bottom, honey. That thing, I in the video that I'm showing you, I had to keep my hand or my finger back there to keep it from dropping down low. My whole backside was hanging out. And I ain't talking about just the top where the, the, the line start. It was way down there. It was scoop scoop. So, <laughs> I don't know if, if it would have worked if I would have got a smaller size. And then it would have fit tighter and not droop down so low. I don't know. But this one right here, honey, she ain't walking outside in this. That's what we're not about to do. This was an extra large. I probably would have had to get a medium. And then that would have fit too tight, even though it's stretchy material. Yeah, I don't know. You just got to find the right fit if you're dead set on getting one of these. Super pretty, $40. But this got to go back to the store. If I could find a medium, maybe I'll try it on and see how the back looks. But I don't know. As of now, I got to take that one back. 
Okay, so then this top right here by Time and True, I got it in a large right here. Super cute color. The sleeves kind of have that like little ruffle thing going on. This was $17.98. They did have this in like a kind of like orange gold color. Uh, didn't have my size. I probably would have picked that up. I don't know how I feel about the sleeves. I'm, I, I like the shirt, but after I tried it on and I'm showing you guys, I didn't actually love it. I like it a lot, but I don't love it. So I'm on the fence about this one. I'm not too sure what I'm doing with it, but for now, yeah. Uh, this blue and white sweatshirt, Time and True, is an extra large. Extra large is a 1618. And it was just the little blue and white stripe. I love that. I think it's super cute. Um, it is $17.98. And I really like how it has the uh, openings, the splits on the side uh, to go over your hips, especially if you have wider hips. And, you know, sometimes the shirt just don't fall right or you got to lift it up and keep it above your, you know, your hips. This one has the, the split so that it'll lay perfectly in the front and the back. So I really like this top. Um, and it's like, it's a sweatshirt, but it's not real, real thick and it's not too thin. So yeah, I like the blue and white stripes. Okay, here's another one that I'm, I'm on the fence about. And I really think I'm going to take this one back. Although I really hate to because the Pioneer Woman, it was that black one that I showed you guys with those pretty colorful sleeves. Um, how much was it? $18.99. When I put it on, I really like it, but I just wasn't really sold on the sleeves. I'm not too happy about this uh cinching part right here at the wrist. It was a little tight on my arm. Um, not too bad, but it was a little too tight. It wasn't comfortable. That's what it, it, it definitely is not comfortable. The shirt itself is really, really stretchy. It's that bouncy kind of stretchy material. And so, yeah, and this is not like that thin kind of sheer material that'll like snag on something or rip or have the little strings hanging out of it. It's really nicely made, but I just didn't really know if I, I don't know if I like the way the sleeves fit. So I'm still thinking about this one. And that one was the Pioneer Woman. Uh, here's another sweater. I, I think you guys knew I was going to get this one, the green one, because I showed this in the video and I was like, ooh, I don't know if I want to get the green or the blue because they have like a royal blue one as well. But I went with the green because it's just super pretty. Uh, $21.98 and I got this in a 1X. Uh, no buttons in the front or anything. Soft, very, very soft and just really pretty. I just love that color. So we went with that. Here is another uh, cardigan. This one is long by Terra Sky. It fits really long. Um, really, really pretty. Love the color. Um, how much? $20.98. I got this in a 1X. It comes with the front pockets. So you can put your you know, hands in the front. Um, and it does also have the, the split up the side right there. So it gives you that extra space as well. So yeah. I just love the color it is, so I had to get it. Okay, so we have two more things. This is Terra Sky. It is like a sweater dress, pretty much the same as the burgundy one. This one was $24.98, kind of like the burgundy one, minus the, the strap in the back or the, the little detail in the back. Um, I thought this fit pretty good. It is a 1X. I think it runs a little big, so to me, even though it was nice and roomy and spacious and it's stretchy, I feel like I should have sized down. So if you are looking for one of these, uh, I would say that it runs a little big. So yeah, but it's Terra Sky, nice and soft and really nicely, nicely made. It will be cute in the winter and in the fall. And then the last item, which I absolutely love, is this brown little Time and True jump set thingy little romper thing this one i got in a large so this one also runs a little bigger so i sized down to a large because the extra large looked way bigger than what it was supposed to so i said let me just try the large and i, I think it fit perfect it comes with a little belted waist and the bottom i didn't really care for the way the bottoms looked um so what i did is i folded it and i like the way that looked better so this is just something cute brown to throw on with my little sweater and some little 
slides or my tennis shoes or whatever and run out the door for something quick and yeah so i wish they would have had they actually i was about to say i wish they would have had this in a different color they did they had it in black but i already picked up i always pick up black stuff so i was like no don't pick up black get the brown so i like the brown and yeah so like i said i will try to put everything down below and um that way if you are interested then you can pick any of those pieces up and last but not least the candles remember when i was in the store and i looked at the candles i wanted to show you guys that i pretty much picked up a few of them and these were those cute candles for 6.98 now let me start off by telling you guys something let me pull them out the bag hold on so i ended up with four different fragrances after smelling all of them and let me tell you guys I haven't burned them yet, but I have high hopes for this one. The home where laundry is magically washed and dried. It was green floral, water lily, and apple blossom. You guys, this smells like fabric softener. Ooh, it smells so good. It smells like the snuggle or downy, the sheets that you put in the dryer. Oh my goodness, this smells so good. So I'm actually going to burn one of these today uh, and hope hope that it smells like what it is in this jar because these smell so fresh and so clean so i picked up two of those i got two of these the sangria is my favorite fruit um and the reason why is because i think my daughter's gonna want one of these and it's the cranberry currant and sweet orange so two of those and then um life is too short to be vanilla that one was vanilla buttercream and marshmallow this one will probably go on my stash until around christmas thanksgiving time because it's a real sweet smell um yeah it's a really sweet smell it makes you feel like there's something baking in the kitchen or something like that so usually my scents like that i save until it starts to cool down because it smells so good you ever leave your house and come back and you smell a good candle and you're like, oh, who baking something? You'd be like, dang, that's a candle. <laughs> Can somebody get in the kitchen and start making some brownies or something? Like, woo. Okay, and then this last one, which I will burn all the time, is coffee and sarcasm, which was hazelnut, caramel, and vanilla. And I just love the smell of coffee. Coffee smells so good. But this one is not too strong. You get a lot of the caramel and the vanilla in here so i went with that one as well and that's it you guys for today's haul from target and walmart um i hope you guys enjoyed this uh i hope it helped you with any of your fall purchases uh because yeah it's coming fast uh and that's it so check down below in the description box i'll try to put whatever i can down there and um i'll talk to you guys real soon in my next video make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done that and stick around i'd love for you to and i'll see you guys in my next video bye